Welcome back everyone, this is Super Star Brother playing The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D Master Quest for the 3DS. We are going through this forest temple. We... We've got the bow and arrows. We uh, have captured two poles, or destroyed them rather. I don't think we actually captured these ones. The ones that have stolen the flames. We are now restoring the flames by... Uh... Let's see now... Let me think. We're not going to be able to... What we need to do is grab this box. Be very careful with it, Navi, please. I'm going to jump over here. Place this box very carefully down on this button. And then jump back across here and pull out our bow and arrow. Hopefully we do this. Hopefully we do this. Fire! Hey, how about that? We did it! And we need to destroy the box because otherwise we will not be able to go through the door. Let me show you. If I can. That is blocked. The door is now blocked by that wall. We have to get rid of this and hopefully not fall into the... Not fall into the red stuff, whatever that stuff is. Maybe lava. I always thought of it as just kind of a... Kind of a death fog. But having gotten rid of that... Get, that box from on the blue button, you should be able to go through the store now. Alright, get lost, you two. So now we need to find the two other poses that have stolen the flames and watch out for monsters that hang from the ceiling, as Navi points out. Alright, now let's. Link, watch out! The ceiling is falling down! Yup, a very deadly ceiling at that, and I nearly got squashed. Squished. So, the sculpture that will let you know where the safe spots are, where the holes are, so if you just go there. Also, if you watch, you should be able to find out which ones are the holes you need to look out for. And probably... Whoa, okay, wow, that shot. Yeah, yeah, okay. Watch out for Scotulas. I don't want to run into them while we step on this button. Which opens that door over there, actually. I want to stay right here. Yep. And then run into this button. I think there might be a sculpture there hiding above. Oh, no, okay. Let's see if we can reach this box before it drops. Yeah, we can if we just get it. If we can get it. Got a bundle of arrows. Got a bundle of arrows. And now let's watch out as we make our way over here. And hopefully, we... there we go. Yeah. Okay, we need to come over here. This is what that button opened, which takes us. Excuse me, if I could. Out here. And what we're going to do out here? Let me think if I can remember how to do this. Oh yes. What we're going to do is we're going to drop down here. Kill that thing. That is a regular Deku Baba. Never thought I'd be so happy to see you. Get the small key from here. And then we're going to jump up here. Play that song of time again. Yeah, they kind of like this song quite a, quite a bit. Once more. These boxes feature feature in dungeons quite a bit more than they did in the original. And I think I bumped something. Whoa, hey. Link, what was that all about? Okay, hopefully I make it. Yeah, we made it. Okay. Let's not drop. Because we don't want to drop. We don't want to... Ooh, yes. Okay. Being careful not to get squashed. Just going to make our way over here. Go ahead and kill that so we can get over here safely. And the rest of it should be just a mad dash towards the door. If we don't get run into if we don't get hit by those guys first. Ow! Stinking hack! I hate you. Yeah, instant death if we get hit, crushed. I hate you! I really do. I really hate those guys. That always seems to happen to me. I run for the door. I make a mad dash for the door, and then some jerk decides to drop in on me and just smack me out of the way when I'm trying to get to safety. I just rude that way. Okay, let's 
see if we can make it through here without hassling with them. Ooh, yes. Okay, this is what we want to do. First off, we're going to stay out of the way of these shadows, otherwise we're going to be crushed. I'm just going to shoot that painting. And we're going to very quickly about do this. We have one minute. We're going to move this out of the way because we do not need it at all. Okay, we're going to push this in. Push that in. We're going to have to push this in. Okay, making sure that we put it all together. If we do not do this in time, it's going to be a very long and painful process. Especially if we like put it all together at the last minute and it, ugh, it's horrible. It is horrible. Just make sure you put this together in time. It'll save you a lot of hassle. Alright, now that we've done that, we should meet this Poe. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey! Amy, one of the Poe sisters! Hey for her when she appears! Ow! So we've met Beth, we've met Joelle, and we have met Amy. Burnt! Stink pot! Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Twice more should get us. Should work, should work, come on. Come on, Amy. Oh, come on, Amy. Come on. What you got? Come on. Get on. Bring it out, little woman. There we go. We have gotten three of them for, so far. We should get the final one. Very soon. Alright. I am still very nervous about quarters like these because I'm pretty sure... Okay. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Okay. I'm happy. I am relieved. I am... Yes. That happens. Okay, here goes nothing. We got this woman who seems to be having an argument with the floor. This one. I can never remember this girl's name. Meg. I don't know why I forget that name. It's very simple. Meg, one of the Poe sisters. If she splits into multiple images, you need to figure out the, which one is the real one. Is it this one? No, actually it's this one. If if I could aim, sometimes that happens and it kind of annoys me. I'm gonna aim for her. I need to aim for the one that is the true one. And that would be the one who's spinning around. If you were to try to attack her using the spin attack, it would not work. All her false ones would disappear and she herself would be unharmed. Giggling madly about it. You could of course attack her then, but... It's just kind of easier just to use the bone arrow. But, out of all of them, Meg is actually the easiest to get. And there we have it. We have gotten all four. We have lit all four torches, destroyed all four Poe sisters, and, uh, that. So let's go down here then. Alright, with this we're going to, let's see, we have a door, we have a set of bars there and a set of bars there. So what we're going to do is take this and push. And you might want to push in one direction, unless I get this wrong and I've pushed it the wrong way. It doesn't look like I have though, so we might... So... Hmm. Doesn't seem like there's anything here, though. There sometimes is. Maybe there is an eye about here. Maybe. Kind of like to be devious about that. But it doesn't look like there's anything here, so I guess we'll go move on. Is there anything on this side, though? Didn't think so. Okay, hold on. Yeah, okay. There isn't. Go ahead and push this over this way. Oh, my blinking eyeballs. That, ah, uh, wait, 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 wait. We don't... 
we want to hit that. Which opens that, and we want to step on this button. Which opens that. Let's see, I don't think there's any gold sculptures in here. There was. Let's just go ahead and come to the right again, and just push this. Push. Says I. Okay, that one is not the way, but this one might be. Yes, it is. Probably want to watch out for something. Well, it's a box, I guess. Which gives us a bundle of arrows. Nice. Wait. Nothing. Okay. Usually, in the original version, you, in the original Ocarina of Time, you could actually... You would have to go through each room and press a button or hit an eye or something like this. In this one, they kind of are a bit more... Uh, you don't do as much, but you still have to go through each and every one of them just to make sure you got everything. Yep, there it is. Found it. And there, I think we have it. We should be able to go through now. Alright, in here... This is kind of interesting. We did not have this in the original Ocarina of Time. But what we now have are some paintings, and, uh, let's see... They seem to be kind of abstract art. But... Maybe the intention is to see if you can find some images in there, and I have... And I think I have found some images in them, just by looking closely at it and thinking, hmm, I wonder if that kind of looks like this, and that, and those, and that. For example, it kind of looks like there might be a skull kid on the bottom, or there might be... I don't know, it's just... I have not been able to find anything definite, though, so I don't really pay too much attention to it. I was wondering if there's some sort of a... Yeah, that might look like Ganon. Might look like Ganon, but it's just so vague and abstract. This one looks like it might be the most... I don't know, maybe a twin roba? Maybe? Yeah, a lot of this stuff is just seems kind of abstract. That one looks like it might be a castle. Maybe. It might be a castle. I have not found anything. That one looks like it might be a Shadow Ganon. That one definitely looks like a, a hulking beast at the very least. Shadow Ganon. This one, this one, um, looks like it might be a forest. Maybe. I don't know. And I have not found anything to indicate that they're significant. But having, since we have already collected our, um, boss key, we should be able to go through here. But, I guess having done that, this is Super Step Brother. To be continued. <laughs>